Hi, I'm Kanthik from Fisherman Training Institute Salala. I welcome you all for this session. In this session, I'm going to teach you how to create a simple website using hyperlink, an expression web for. Once again, I repeat the topic: how to create a simple website using hyperlink, an expression web for. Let me see right now. Uh, open Microsoft Expression Web Four by just clicking the icon. So anyway, this task is going to be a very simple task, and you guys are going to enjoy it. Okay, so first, I'm going to create an empty website. How to create an empty website? Here, you can able to see an option site, a site menu. You just click on site menu. When you click on site menu, a pop-up will be displayed. So where you want to select new site. Okay, again site, and you want to click new site. Once you click on new site, a new dialog box will appear where it consists of general. By default, general will be selected, and in general, there are three options: open on-page site, empty site, and import site. Our task is we want to create an empty website. So in order to create an empty website, you want to click empty site. Click on empty site, and then and what to how to change the location? Okay, so just click on browse. So in desktop, I'm going to create a new folder. Let us say fisherman training. Open it. Okay, and now you can able to see the location has been changed, and click OK to accept the change. So now an empty website has been created. So now our task is we want to add web pages to the empty website. How to add the empty web page to our website? It's very simple. Go to File and New. Where you can able to see HTML, right? Once again, I repeat. Go to File, New, and HTML. So now I'm going. I want to save this HTML first. So here's the option Save, or else go to File, where you can find Save. So I'm going to use Save. So let us say it's going to be the home page. Save it. Now I'm going to type the text Fisherman Training Institute. Okay. The say Salala. Okay. Now select the text and make it bold and make it center. It's a center alignment. And then I'm going to increase the size. How to increase the size? Here is a default size. When you click on default size, a drop-down will appear where you can able to select double X large. And if you want to change the font family, you can able to change it. Just go through the font family, and whichever you like, you can change it. Now. I'm going to insert a picture. How to insert a picture? So go to insert, and here is a picture, and from file. And one more way is there. Here in toolbar, where you can able to see this a picture. Insert picture from file. You can use this option also. Okay. So I'm going to select the logo. When you click on logo, it will ask for the alternate text. I'm going to give fisherman, and description is logo. And click OK. So now I'm going to minimize the size. And drag it and drop it as you like. And once again, I'm going to insert one more picture right here. So file insert. Let us say. Fisherman main logo. Let's say logo and click OK. 
so now you can able to reduce the size okay after now i want to insert tabs menus let us say first is going to be home then i'm going to leave some space let us say to tab and then let us say depart department to tab and then about us and then contact us okay then save this and save now the automatically the logo will be saved in the corresponding directory you can able to see the logo has been changed sorry save okay next i want to create the uh, web pages department about us and contact us okay so how to create a new web page same file new html so now you save it so let us say department so now i'm going to type fisherman twining institute salala okay just select the text make it bold make it center alignment and change the font size and change the font and next let us type what are the departments let us say department of key skills department of english department of electronics and coastal fishing captains okay then select everything if you want to change the background color for this here is your option where you can able to change background color and click locate the color and apply now i'm going to make left alignment and make it bold and if you want to change the font you can change the font and then if you want to list order it yes you can do it so how to do this just select here is the order list and unordered list this one is an order list okay then if you want to change the font color here is the option as a font color to change it select change the font color and apply it so now we can change the font color and save it so again we want to create a new html file file new html and save this is on about us about us and save it now i'm going to type about fisherman training institute so make it center select center bold change the font size and font family and then if you want to give the background color yes and next let us say about fti so make it left now i'm going to type something about fti fisherman training institute let us say fisherman training institute 
is located at Salala AFTI is a very good VTC vacation training institute FTI provides good environment for students okay then say this and make it bold okay and then again we want to create one more web page go to file new and HTML and save save it so it is going to be contact contact us okay so first type the name of the institution so fisherman fisherman twining institute salala okay make it center and make it bold change your font size and change the font family let us say contact details and uh, you want to provide the address okay for example PO box number and then location and let us say Salala and Omen. So I'm going to select this and make it left alignment and then to say mobile number and email ID and fax number then serve it and go to a home page so how to go to home so just click to home.html now select department and we want to provide an hyperlink how to provide the hyperlink first select the text and insert here is the hyperlink shortcut is control K or else in toolbar where you can able to see and symbol this is called a hyperlink you can use this click on a hyperlink and where you can have all the pages so it's going to be department just click on department click OK and now select about us and go to hyperlink and search for about us and then contact us just select the text and go to hyperlink contact us click OK now if you want to change the hyperlink color go to format and go to background so where we'll be having the hyperlink colors you can able to change the colors and visit hyperlink color and active hyperlink and click OK so now how to run this okay ensure that your home page is selected first okay and then go to file and go to preview in browser one second I repeat before you want to ensure that the home page has been selected then go to file and preview in browser click any one of the installed browsers like Chrome or Internet Explorer now your website is ready so it's a very simple website so 
when you click on department it will go to the department and when you click on about us it will go to about us and when you click on contact us it will take you to the contact us page so this is an and simple website i think you guys may enjoy this video thanks for watching this video thank you